Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. We are back with another Sims 4 video today. First we had an update announcement, then we had a kit announcement, then we had a summer's worth of things announcement. Like, what is the Sims team doing? They go silent for months and then they just talk and talk and talk and talk and talk, but it's good for me because it gives me things to do videos on. So here I am, I'm doing a video. Basically, I'm here to talk about all the news that came out yesterday and the, the in the last couple of weeks. Basically, I haven't done a video on this and so I'm putting them all in one video, okay? They're all here in this video so that if you don't know anything about what happened in the last couple of weeks, last week or so, basically, here, it's all here. <laughs> This is the video for you because I'm here to talk about it, okay? So basically, I think it was the 13th. Not 100% sure about this. We got an update. Okay, it was the 13th. I was right about that. Basically, if you haven't updated your game, go ahead and do that. So, updated the game everyone and this is what you can see in it these are the patch notes i know the update happened like a couple days ago so this is old news at this point but basically we got quite a few new things and a bunch of new asian eye presets which is really cool and really great we really needed that for diversity really really great and i'm so happy that it came to the game we really needed it so you can see here all the new Asian eye presets. Also, you can see here that they also finally fixed the afro that we have been looking at forever for them to fix. They said they were gonna fix this one a while ago. They finally fixed it. So this should be fixed in your game. Looks great, looks wonderful. It should be all fixed in wonderful in your game for all ages, all genders, you know, perfectly fixed, good to go, looks way better than the old one. I still don't absolutely love it. I still think it looks a little fake. I'm gonna be honest about that, but it's way better, so I can't complain about it, you know? I feel like I'm never gonna be happy with this hair just because of how bad the other one was. So I, I just will never be happy with it. I mean, here was the original. So, you know, it, it could be worse. This is definitely a million times better than this, you know? So I'm just saying, <laughs> it could be a lot worse. This is the old one. This is a monstrosity. I don't know how this was in the base game since 2014. I don't I don't know how that happened. EA explain that one. I don't I don't want to it's so bad. It it's so so bad. I don't want to look at it anymore. I don't I don't want that. I, I I don't want it. They also fixed this hair in the game. I really like it. The the one that they fixed, I think it looks way better. I think it looks super cute now. Great for all genders, all ages. I think it's really cute. I will be using this hair. I think it's really good. Then there are a couple bug fixes that obviously you can read through. So that is a quick overview of the patch notes and what came in the update. They said it wasn't that big of an update. I think this is quite a big update. And these Asian eye presets was not expected at all. We knew that this hair and this hair were coming in this update, but we didn't know anything about the Asian eye presets. That is such a great thing to come in this update. And I am so happy that they put it in here. You know, like I am so happy that they thought about that and knew that we needed that, you know, that is such an extra thing and such a great thing for them to add to the game. On May 13th, they also announced a new kit pack. So I don't know how you feel about kits. I'm not sure how I feel about kits. I, I thought I would hate them, to be honest, and I'm not sure that they're really worth $5, 
But I like the Country Kitchen pack, so I mean, maybe it is worth it. I like that pack. Now, I don't own any of them, and I don't think I'll ever buy any of them, but I do like it. So, I don't know. I don't like any of the other ones, and I don't think I will buy them, but I do like the idea that you can buy them if you'd like, you know, and they're very, very specific. They're super specific. And this one, I think, is honestly the most specific of them all. Courtyard Oasis Kit. Courtyard Oasis Kit. Now, I don't see myself ever using this. <laughs> I mean, not in my types of builds. Like, this, for me, just wouldn't fit my style. So I'm not gonna buy this. But you go ahead and buy it if you want it, you know? That's why it's great. Because... It's, you know, only $5, so you're only buying a small amount of things and for a decently cheap price now. $5 is a little high, maybe, for the amount of stuff that comes in here, but I don't know. It's... Eh. We're all debating about this. This is in a Moroccan style, which is honestly really interesting and is really cool. So, I don't know, that's very interesting. Maybe I'll do a Moroccan build if I was going to buy this pack, which I'm probably not. But, I don't, maybe you could do a Moroccan build and show me it. It sounds pretty cool. This kit pack was leaked like two weeks ago. I <laughs> So, I knew about it two weeks ago. I don't know if you knew about it two weeks ago, but now I'm telling you like, four days after it was already released. <laughs> so, now you're hearing it again. <laughs> Today, everyone, was the big news. This is what we all wanted to see. This is what we care about. Summer of Sims, okay? This is why we're here. This is why we care, okay? This is what we wanted to see. This is why you came to this video, okay? I know. I know. But basically, we wanted to see the lineup of things coming to The Sims this summer. They did this last summer too, and it was kind of great. It told us what was coming, it told us what to look forward to. I'm pretty sure it was last summer, not positive about that. Maybe it was like last year, doesn't matter. Basically, they also told us last year what was coming to The Sims. And it was honestly great because it told us the orders of the packs, it told us what to look forward to, and we are once again getting this. So, I am going to go super in-depth and try to figure out what these packs are going to be. I'm not probably going to be right about this. I'm going to be honest about that. So, don't get your hopes up. But, I'm going to do my best, <laughs> I guess. So, first of all, we have the Courtyard and Chill with a relaxing new kit. Obviously, we know what that is. That's the Moroccan courtyard, whatever, kit pack, whatever it's called. That pack. So, that pack is coming out May 18th, which is actually today. So, it's already out. Get it. Yay. <laughs> Next is Snag a Cool New Career with a Creative New Game Pack. So, this game pack, I think my best guess is it's going to be coming out in June. Now it says down here, subject to change with EA's discretion. So don't get your hopes about that either. They could change this. But, so snag a cool new career with a creative new game pack. So I think it is a possibility that this pack could have something to do with musical things like music or something like this art I don't know we don't have a specifically musical career we have an entertainment career which you can go into a music branch but not a specific music career so I don't know if we're gonna get a, some sort of music career I don't know about that that's an interesting idea I guess Go big for pride at the virtual block party. So this is obviously some sort of pride event. I don't really know what it's going to be, but maybe it has to do with an update or something like that. Some sort of 
they're adding some sort of pride event into the game. I don't know. Something like that. And rock out at the Sims event of the summer. So, I don't exactly know what this- none of these I know anything about. Like, I read this this morning and I was just like, how am I going to do a video on this? <laughs> I was like, I don't know. I'm not good at these things. How am I? I I'm going to be honest. This one, the only thing that stands out to me is rock out. I'm, I'm psychoanalyzing these. Maybe they just said this just because they thought it'd be fun. I don't know. Maybe. I, rock out. Maybe bands. I don't know. Maybe we're getting bands. Okay. I want bands. I want bands in the game, okay? I want bands in the game. <laughs> I want my stupid garage bands. For my stupid teenagers, okay? Sorry. We need to calm down. I am editing now and I am realizing that while I was completely going insane about bands and talking about how much I want bands in the game, I realized that I never talked about how it's actually a Sims event of the summer. <laughs> I never actually talked about what event that would be. I think it might be a festival or something like that. Something like Coachella. I don't know. That's my idea. That's what people seem to be saying. I don't know. If you don't know what Coachella is, basically it's like this big thing where people have a- they just go and watch a bunch of bands. So that maybe that's maybe something like that and maybe we'll get bands in that process of them putting that into the game hopefully that's it maybe it's something like that i don't know maybe it's another festival that they're adding into the game i don't know that seems like maybe what it is ride three waves of base game updates so i basically know what this one is or at least i have a good guess my best guess is we're getting the base game update with all the new hair colors that are coming to the game. If you haven't seen that leak, basically they accidentally leaked all the new hair colors in one of the live streams. So we're gonna get that in some update. We're not really sure. I think that's this month, though I'm not positive. So that's gonna be the next update. We're gonna get that one. And then we're gonna get one with the game pack. Then I think the last update is we're gonna get one with the expansion pack. We always get one with every single pack, so that's probably the best guess. Though, it might be wrong, I don't know, they might do it differently, but that's probably the best guess. We usually get one big update a month, so it's probably a good guess. Finally, bond with nature in this charming new expansion pack. Now, this is the one that it seems like people are speculating on the most, and they're giving me the most hints. <laughs> Because I needed hints, okay? I really needed hints on these because I didn't know what to think. You know, I, I didn't- I needed help. And the help that came was farming. It could be a farming pack. Some people thought fairies, some people thought farming. I- I want to think farming, okay? I really want to think farming. Please just- please be farming. I- I don't want another occult sim. I just, I really want farming, please. Please. <laughs> we already have ghosts and spellcasters and vampires and how many other ones? I don't even, we have so many. All I want is a stupid farm, okay? I don't even care about the farm farming as much as the others, but I all I want is my stupid farm. Honestly, I have most of the packs in the game that I really want, except for generations. But I don't see a generations type pack here. Bond with nature in this charming new expansion pack. Doesn't really fit into generations and snag a cool new career with a creative new game pack. I don't think generations is going to be a game pack and that also doesn't fit but basically I don't see a generations type pack here. I'm gonna be honest about that and generations is the only type pack that I really really still want in the game so I think we're gonna have to wait for Generations if it's coming to The Sims 4. 
which is a little sad. The last thing that I noticed in this whole thing was, where will you take your Summer of Sims? So that's a little, a little weird thing to say. I don't know, maybe it means nothing and maybe I'm entirely reading into this, but I thought that maybe that means that we're getting a world in the game pack as well. I could be wrong. I don't know. It could be wrong about that entirely. Because it seems like it means that there are at least two different things. Because it's two different places that you can go, it seems like, in this lineup. Now that we know that there's a nature expansion pack coming, maybe this tweet from Sim Guru George on April 23rd is making some sense now. It basically says, it's Friday. You can only play in one world until Monday morning. What world do you choose and what lot do you start on? Simguru Frost replied, I choose Redacted. And here is where it started with all of the Redacted nonsense. If you haven't seen this entire thing, I'm gonna read it out to you. And we're gonna kind of maybe try to figure out some where some people have started to think that maybe fairies are involved in the next pack. Simguru George says, you know that Redacted only works if you're playing with Redacted Sims in the new Redacted. What? What is that? I don't know. So basically, some people think that the with redacted sims is like with fairy sims or something. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, this person said, you know that the world only works if you're playing with fairy sims in the new fairy things. I don't know if that's right or anything, but she says, fairies are too small and can only be in the world. Normal sims are too big to fit there. It's a little interesting actually to think about. I think the next game pack or expansion pack is going to have something to do with an occult sim. So I think the expansion pack is a better guess just because it already comes with the world and that conversation on Twitter was talking about a world. So obviously our first guess is going to go to an expansion pack, obviously. And because now that we know it's a nature pack, our best guess is going to be fairies or werewolves, which is other people's guesses. I don't know. I'm not all for the whole occult sim type thing. I play suburban houses with families that are normal. I want generations and I don't want fairies, but that's fine. Fairies are pretty. I don't know. It, we'll survive, okay? We'll, we'll deal with it. <laughs> we'll move on. It's fine. I'm sure it'll be a great pack. Everyone, tell me in the comments down below what you think these packs are. Tell me your ideas. I want to know because obviously you can tell in this video I don't really have an idea. Like, I just throw in my ideas out there because I, I don't really know. Mostly they're other people's ideas, I'll be honest. But... Those are, those are my ideas. Those are the notes I wrote down over here. So, I mean, you can tell me in the comments down below if you agree with that, if you think that fairies are coming, if you think that we're gonna get a new music career, because I would be excited for the music career. I, I'm excited for that. So, if you are also excited about that, definitely tell me that. On that note, I am going to go. Thank you all for watching. If you like this video, make sure I can subscribe to my channel and come back next time for another speed build. Bye, everybody.